more details are coming out about what unfolded in the months before Jeremy Giambi died by suicide. The former Oakland Athletics player died in early February at age 47 his cause of death was confirmed as a suicide two days later. A report from the LA County Coroner, obtained by People Thursday, reveals that Giambi was hit with a baseball in August 2021, breaking his cheekbone. Giambi had not been the same since, the incident, his mother, who found him unresponsive after his death, told authorities per the coroner's report she said the athlete was very negative, emotional, and paranoid following the injury. She shared that although the Giambi, who was working as a pitching coach at the time, had surgery to treat the injury, he seemed different he also went to a neurologist but was never officially diagnosed with any condition she said after the injury, Giambi was very negative and would let the smallest things ruin his day. Following Giambi's death, a number of MLB teams as well as current and former stars shared their condolences to the Giambi family. Alex Rodriguez, who played on the New York Yankees with Jayambis' older brother Jason, wrote on Twitter, heartbroken to hear the news about Jeremy Jayambis passing he was the ultimate competitor on the diamond just 47, gone way too soon my thoughts are with his family and friends RIP. The Oakland has shared a statement via their official Twitter account, We are heartbroken to learn of the passing of a member of our green and gold family, Jeremy Giambi We offer our condolences to Gene, Jason, and his family and friends. The Philadelphia Phillies, for whom Giambi played in 2002, also issued a statement on Twitter, the Phillies are saddened to hear the news of Jeremy Jayamba's tragic passing our condolences go out to his family during this very difficult time. Giambi played a career total of 510 games during his time in the MLB, clocking in 52 home runs, 209 RBIs, and had a 263 batting average over six years in the league, according to Baseball Reference. In addition to being an integral part of the four organizations he played for from the late 90s to early 2000s, Jeremy and his older brother, Jason, were portrayed in the 2011 movie Moneyball, 